No deep fryer is required here. We're going to make these buffalo wings right here in the oven, and they turn out crispy every time. And making sure that they turn out crispy begins with patting each piece dry with paper towels. Then, in a large bowl, combine cornstarch, baking powder, garlic powder, salt, and pepper. Mix it together well and then dust the chicken evenly with it, shaking off any excess. The cornstarch and baking powder will help to draw out moisture from the skin, allowing it to become crispy and flavorful without a thick crust. Now, line a sheet pan with aluminum foil and a baking rack. Generously grease the rack and place the chicken on top, leaving a little space between each piece. This setup allows air to flow around the wings while they bake, keeping them away from the drippings that could otherwise make them soggy. Since we want the wings crispy on both sides, partway through the cooking process, we're gonna give them a flip. And while the chicken is in the oven, becoming beautifully browned and crispy like this, it's time to make the buffalo sauce. Combine the butter, brown sugar, garlic powder, and hot sauce in a microwavable bowl. Heat until the butter melts and stir and stir and stir a little more and stir a little more until the butter is no longer separating from the other ingredients and the sugar is completely dissolved. Check this out, they're almost done. Nice and browned and crispy, and now all we have to do is slather them in buffalo sauce. Finally, you coat all those beautiful crispy pieces of chicken in the sauce and plate them up with blue cheese dressing and celery, and you are ready to dig in. You can find the recipe for crispy baked buffalo wings at homewithshay.com. Shay Ryan, ABC Action News.